Hello from brothers and sisters, it's time for new real life tactic, today we are going to track Simone Inzaghi and his tactic at Lazio. Lazio is playing really interesting football in formation 3-5-2 and there are a variety of methods uh, for creating chances. Sergei Milinkovic Savic and Luis Alberto are key players and they are pushing forward in front of Lucas Leiva who is playing a little bit more defensive in the middle. Uh, most of actions are through the middle. Uh, the biggest problem about this tactic is when they're playing against teams who are playing counter-attacks. Okay, now let's see Lazio uh, team stats for the season 2020-2021. Possession 50.8, 64 goals in 41 matches in all competitions. 97 yellow cards and one red card, really big number of yellow cards. Ciro Immobile is top goal scorer. Okay, so guys, this is how I see Simone Inzaghi tactic at Lazio in this year. In attack, we have Immobile and Correa. Uh, Correa is playing as advanced forward, Immobile is playing as a complete forward. Maybe there is another role suitable for Immobile and that's pressing forward. Uh, Correa is uh, always looking for a free space, but sometimes he is creating something for Immobile. Immobile is coming down to receive the ball, he's roaming from position and he's top goal scorer. Really classy player, guys. Uh, with these attributes, uh, uh, he should score many goals for your team. Okay, uh, then we have Luis Alberto, heart of this team, the best technician in this team, a really classy player, and he's going play to play as advanced playmaker, attacking duty. They're running up, uh, same thing with Milinkovic Savic, who is also running up, helping attack. Maybe another suitable role for Milinkovic Savic is to play uh, like Mezala, but with box to box, Mitra had better results. Then behind them we have Lucas who is playing as a ball winning midfielder. Uh, maybe it's uh, another suitable role for him is to play as an anchor man. Okay, then three central defenders, Rado on the left side, Aserbi as a ball playing defender. He's someone who is creating all the things from defense. He is the best player there, I mean player with the best technical attributes, best passing skills. And on the right side we have uh, Patrick, uh, Spanish uh, fullback or central defender. Also ball playing defender, also has some nice passing skills. Okay, left side is more attacking. On left side is playing Marusic, uh, so he's more attacking than on the right side uh, where we have Lazari. Marusic is a really interesting Montenegrin wing back. Some nice speed, but problems a bit with the dribbling and crossing. On the right side we have Lazari, uh, he's okay, he can cover almost whole right side. The, the best thing about Manuel Lazari is that he has incredible crossing, 16. So maybe if you're playing with this tactic, maybe it's not a bad idea to use Lazari as a more attacking player, yeah. Okay, now let's check team instructions. So for Simone Inzaghi I choose positive mentality and the most important team instructions playing through the middle, yeah. But uh, still they're waiting for wing back, special left side, Marusic is a little bit more attacking. So uh, overlap left, overlap right, play out to defense, we said that the Serbi is creating all the things in, uh, from their uh, defense, uh, then passing directness is standard uh, and tempo is a bit high in my opinion. Work ball into box and mix it crosses. In transition, uh, counter press counter. Sometimes there are games where when Lazio is making big uh, pressure on opponents, high pressing, but sometimes they're not doing so. There's some different uh, thinking about this. Yeah, uh, the goalkeeper takes short uh, kicks to uh, full backs. Then out of possession, let's say that uh, Lazio is playing with a hard defensive line. Um, the line of engagement, maybe a uh, higher, yeah, not, not the highest possible. Uh, prevention will keep a distribution, playing with two strikers, uh, they're doing this. Uh, let's say extremely urgent pressing and get stuck in. A lot of yellow cards for Lazio in this season. Okay, uh, now let's see how this tactic looks on the pitch. Let's see some goals and uh, what kind of results I made. Okay, so this was my match against Benevento, which won 5-3, and you're going to see a uh, goal like in real life. Marusic has the ball on the left side, he's more on the more attacking side. Uh, we see behind him, uh, we have Luis Alberto, who is heart of this team, somebody who is creating all the things. And already we have two strikers there, and that's in this match, that, that was Salcedo and Correa. Also, we see Sergei Milinkovic Savic is coming in the box. He's ready to score the goal. On the right side, also, we have Lazari, who is playing as a right wing back. Only one player, that's Lucas, staying back all the time, covering defense. So, Luis Alberto has the ball. He's giving great cross to Sergei Milinkovic Savic, guys. Sergei Milinkovic Savic is totally free on the right side. 
and uh, I mean Sergei Milinkovic uh, is most of games is playing as a box to box or Mezala. So he's uh, most in most of situations in real life he's running an opponent box, and that's a great header by Sergei Milinkovic Savic. So guys, these are my results with this tactic. Tactic is not brilliant, but it's not bad either. Third place, qualified for Champions League. It's okay for Lazio, 76 points. He had many draws, that's the only problem. 10 draws, 6 loses and 22 wins. I mean, with some tweaks, this tactic can be really awesome. Okay, now let's check team detail stats. Team detail stats is saying that we were we had the best defense in the league. And this is the best thing about this tactic. Considered, we have considered only 23 goals. Uh, but uh, we didn't have, uh, we didn't score too many goals, only 9 plays, 49 goals. Average possession, almost like in real life. Uh, in real life, Lazio has uh, 50% uh, in FM now, with this tactic, 49% average possession. Okay, now let's check stats of all the players. And my top goal scorer was Ciro Immobile, of course, the best player of Lazio with uh, 11 goals, 1 assist. Uh, Joaquin Correa, 11 goals also for him, 4 assists, then uh, Andrew Anderson, fantastic season for him, uh, he scored uh, uh, 9 goals and had 6 assists, Philip Saicedo, 7 goals, Luis Alberto, 6 goals and 6 goals for Sergei Milinkovic Savic. Now let's check, uh, we see that Luis Alberto has the bigger number of, of assists, 14 assists, and that's good because he's playing as an advanced playmaker. And Anda Marusic, 10 assists, more attacking side, and this is why he had more assists than Lazario on the right side. Okay, and at the end guys, I just want to ask you, do you think that uh, I did nice analyze of this Simone Inzaghi tactic at Lazio? Uh, would you add something uh, leave your comments and of course if you like this kind of videos if you want from me to do more real life tactics in fm 2021 then hit the like button subscribe or become a member thank you for watching and see you bye bye